All right. I have the Salsa King, Angel Alvarez, on the show now. He'll be facing Daniel Sanchez on March the 24th at Combate Global. Good to talk to you. And I'm excited to see you back in action. You're 4-0 now as a pro, and you're at Sanford MMA, one of the best gyms on planet Earth. How has this camp been for you this far? My camp now, this camp is very, very good. It's better than... Uh, de mejor que el anterior, mucho mejor que el anterior fue. Eh, me siento mucho mejor preparado para esta pelea que todos los demás. Nunca me había preparado tan bien desde que estoy en el MMA. Nunca me había preparado tan bien como me lo he preparado. Um, this camp is definitely different than the others. This one, he, he feels, you know, like he trained very, very um, hard for. So he's never trained as hard as he's trained. And, and so he feels, you know, ready for this, uh, for the fight. And like he had a definitely a, a good training camp. All right. And I, I see that you have Gilbert Burns as a training partner, Kevin Lee, uh, some of the, the best fighters uh, in the world. How much better has your skill set got since you've been at Sanford MMA? Um, 50%. I'm 50%. I feel like I'm. Um, in, in MMA is now I feel good, I feel um, comfortable, comfortable, confiable. Uh, I siento, I, I feel hard, strong. I feel good. I feel good. For me, it's fifty percent. Okay. All right. Well, I'm excited to see what is next uh, as your evolution keeps on uh, growing here. Now you're you're four and zero as a pro, as I mentioned earlier. You've had two KO wins and two decisions. Are, are you happy with the decision wins or are you a little disappointed that you didn't get uh, another couple of finishes there? I'm happy, I'm happy. This is my, my process in my career. I feel good, I'm happy with me. Uh, this is normal, For falling up is good for me. Um, two for 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 knockout is good. Um, two for decision unanimous is good. I feel good. Now I, I understand you have a, a judo background. W when did you know that you wanted to get into to combat sports? Uh, did you always know that this was going to be your path? Que él sabe que tienes un fondo en en judo. ¿Cuándo es que tú sabías que querías entrar al in my life, all all my life, I train in judo. And judo is the uh, combat sport. Uh, MMA is more aggressive. Is um, when the, I I think I think I think um, inside in MMA. When the, uh, I said in, in Cuban, eh, yo decidí como irme hacia los Estados Unidos y supe que iba a estar en ese deporte porque en Cuba no lo practiqué mucho, pero practiqué algo de bolseo. De, algo. Um, when he left Cuba, he, he, to come to the United States, he knew that he was going to go into MMA. Um, that's, you know, something that he, that he wanted to do. He, he practiced a little bit in Cuba, not much, um, but he definitely practiced boxing. So when he left Cuba to come to the United States, he knew that, you know, he wanted to go into MMA. Okay. And obviously your nickname is the Salsa King. Are you a, a better salsa dancer or, or a better mixed martial artist? I see that in MMA. The salsa, I love the salsa. I dance in salsa. Bro. My salsa is, is different. It's different country. Uh, I go a Voy como letter by letter. More salsa, more practice, more MMA. Better is in MMA. Okay. What makes a good salsa dancer? I imagine just being an athlete it would lead you to believe that you could be a good salsa dancer, but what kind of attributes do you have to have to, to be a good salsa dancer? 
de qué es lo que necesita uno para ser un, un bailarín bueno en la salsa. O sea, él piensa que capaz siendo un atleta, o sea, puede ser que tú ya tienes cualidades que, que piensas que puedes bailar salsa, pero ¿qué, ¿qué necesita uno para ser un bailarín bueno en la salsa? Whatever people, whatever people for, for, for dancing good, perfect, is en focus, training, discipline, in whatever, in whatever situation, dancing, MMA, is whatever. It's only practice, dedication, and focus, sacrifice, y vas a ser el mejor. You go the best. And you'll be the best. <laughs> okay, I, I love it. Now, for anybody out there who hasn't seen you fight yet, is, is there a fighter that's, you know, extremely well known that you would compare your overall skill set to? Is there someone that your, your MMA game uh, is similar? Por alguien que no ha visto, que no te ha visto peleando todavía. Eh, si hay un peleador que tú puedes como compararte tus calidades con esa persona, por ejemplo, por alguien que no te ha visto todavía. Um, o sea, a mí me... Um, I like the um, uh, Israel Israel Ansaya is my favorite fight. Uh, I watch Israel Ansaya the the movimiento um, in boxing Canelo. That's, pero yo no me com, no me comparo con ellos. Solo trato de seguir el ejemplo bueno de cada una persona. Yeah, he says that he you know as fighters he likes to watch Israel Adesanya and he also likes to to watch Canelo in boxing, um, but he doesn't actually compare himself to to them. Uh, what he tries to do is is to like lead by their example, or you know to, to try to follow in their footsteps. Okay. Those are a couple of great answers right there. I love it. Now you're, you're fighting at lightweight, uh, 155 pounds. What is that weight cut for you like? Is, is it a significant weight cut or do you make that pretty easy? My process for my cutaway is, is normal. It's normal. Um, when the, I, if, Cuando voy como for a fisting pound, this is more difficult. Pero that is normal, that is normal. I need dedication training two times, three times. The work, the same day, three times, every day, two times for my cut away. But that is normal, I see that. Okay, all right. And so again, your, your opponent, uh, Daniel Sanchez, this is March 24th at Combate Global. Who are you going to have in your corner come fight night? For now, I think that, uh, I think uh, Dieter, Dieter Navarro is my coach, my principal coach, and my girlfriend. My girlfriend all the time here in my life, in my sport, he supported me he, all the time. I have my girlfriend in the corner. In the, in the corner. All right. And Daniel Sanchez, what, what kind of a fighter is he? What kind of a fight are you expecting uh, come uh, March 24th? ¿Qué tipo de peleador es Daniel Sanchez y qué tipo de pelea estás esperando el 24 de marzo? I'm waiting for the fight, more wrestling, jiu-jitsu. For uh, why is for um, Daniel Sanchez, jiu-jitsu, jiu-jitsu. He practiced Jiu-Jitsu and I, he, he liked Jiu-Jitsu in the fight. I waited for the Jiu-Jitsu wrestling. I, I don't like Jiu-Jitsu. I like striking, show, beautiful show. So do, are, do you anticipate getting a, a knockout on the feet here? What is your official prediction? ¿Cuál es tu predicción si tú ves como un knockout o, o como tú ves algo? My prediction is God. If Gab he won knockout, okay, knockout. If, if Gab he won decision, unanime, no decision, I don't, I don't know. It's Gab. This is my 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 prediction. My prediction. Sorry. Okay. All right. Nan, I, I have to imagine that big things are expected from you, from the people that are around you moving forward. So if you get this win and you move to five and zero. Oh, do you feel like maybe Dana White's contender series makes sense for you next? Or like, what are you hoping is next for you? Después de esa pelea, como favorito que sea 5 a 0, entonces, ¿qué es como la próxima, el próximo paso? ¿Qué es lo que piensas para el futuro capaz de contender de Dana White? ¿O qué es lo que tú quieres después de eso? 
Um, I have a contract. I have a contract when combating. Um, I need um, to finish the contract. After, uh, I don't know. I won. I won fight for UAC. Is big company. Is big company. But this is if now. This is my my opinion. Is gonna. I don't know the the fishing. I don't know. I don't know what's the fishing. For now, I have a four a five five for the contra when combate. Um, next, <laughs> I don't know. Okay, well, I'm excited to see you uh, fight again. Uh, again, March 24th, Combate Global. Angel Alvarez meets Daniel Sanchez. Thank you so much for the time today. Before I let you go, I, I want to give you the floor. Tell people where to follow you on social media. And if you have anyone to thank, any sponsors, the floor is yours. And for the last word, if you want to give thanks to someone, and if you can tell people where they can follow you on Instagram or whatever, and who wants to give thanks, Thank you. The first time, thank you, God. Thank you, God, for, for this opportunity. Thank you. Thank you for your time, for your share. Thank you, Sanford, my gene. Thank you, Combate Global. Thank you, Dira Navarro, my coach principal. Thank you, Henry Hoof, for the open the door in, in, in the gene, the Sanford MMA. Thank you, Take Down. Thank you, everybody, for for supporting me, please follow me, Angel Alvarez um, underscore. underscore MMA in Instagram. Thank you.